Good morning, guys. I just got a wake-up call from the hospital. So they finally um, called me back to book the appointment to check the umbilical cord and they say that they checked that at 28 weeks. So I have to go back, uh, I believe July 9th, July 17th, I think she said. Hmm, pregnancy brain moment. I just got off the phone with her, wow. Um, but anyways, so yeah, I'm not worried yet. Um, I'm not worried at this point. You know, I'm just going to wait and see. I'm not going to get all worked up for nothing. Um, I feel exhausted yet again. New trend. Yay. But I have like, I don't know, maybe it's like a, called a sciatic nerve or something. It's like my lower back or on top of my bum on the right side where it's like this kind of shooting pain that goes down. And it hurts a lot at night. So I tend to toss and turn and not fall asleep until the morning. So I get... Well, I get my few hours of sleep once Jim leaves for work in the morning. Yeah, so I always feel kind of zombie-ish, but that's okay. It's to be expected. Oh, and then I was, when the doc, when the hospital called and I did like a little stretch because it just like woke me up, um, I got the most painful Charlie horse in my left calf. Like, you know, when it feels like, a tendon just gets or a muscle or something just gets caught on something and just uh, like where the shape of your calf looks different you can tell and it feels so hard and it's just blinding pain for a few seconds until it like releases but I haven't had one of those in forever but leave it to baby boy to uh, remind me of how lovely those are oh you look so depressed over there hmm why are you just sitting over there? You're not sitting on the couch or on the bed. You're not here with me. What's going on? Are you depressed? Don't be depressed. So this pregnancy craving has cost me an arm and a leg. Cherries are so expensive at my grocery store, but I'm finally craving something healthy, so I'm definitely going to get it. I've just been craving um, pizza and um, french fries cake, cookies, chocolate, all that stuff um, my entire pregnancy. The only healthy craving I've had is oranges and I've eaten those by the bushel. So I'm definitely going to get baby cherries if he wants it because yeah it's very rare <laughs> I crave something healthy. You waiting patiently for a cherry? As always? Always the same story with you eh? Hmm? Oh there was a little bit of Canadian coming out. Eh? Yeah. Everybody makes fun of my Canadian sounding accent. I don't hear it at all. I know that I say A a lot, but it's the perfect word to mean, don't you think? Wouldn't you agree? But it's just one little sound, eh? Look how scruffy your face looks. Look how scruffy. You're scruffy, eh? So this is a little sneak peek of our nursery. Um, it kind of gives you an idea of what we're going for. Um, gray, white, light blue, very soft and neutral with kind of like elephant details here and there. But I'll definitely give you a full tour of everything that's in this little nursery nook once I have my shower and get everything for baby. Jim is home from work. You enjoying your video games? I am. I'm a little tired though, taking my nap. <laughs> Dinner's ready, you can't. I'll so, be what are you playing? Final Fantasy. I like it better than the angry Grand Theft Auto or. I never get angry at Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, you do. Well, okay, no, Grand Theft Auto has like a very angry soundtrack. And um, what's the other one? Black Ops. Call of Duty. Call of Duty, you get very angry at. Hi, little guy. Um, so dinner's ready now, so get to a point that you can pause.
So this is what we've got going on for dinner tonight. I am making some bean burritos. So I've washed up some black beans and corn and I've washed a ton of romaine lettuce because not only are we gonna have a lot tonight in our burritos, but I'm gonna have enough to make taco salads tomorrow for lunch, like prep them tonight. Um, I've shredded some cheddar cheese, cut up some tomatoes. We have sour cream, Frank's Red Hot, salsa and of course our tortilla shells so i'm super excited to devour the only thing we don't have is avocado because they didn't look too good but um yeah this is going to be delicious so this is the finished product of the bean burrito and as soon as i can get an instagram worthy picture i'm gonna devour it and probably two of them i'm not gonna lie looks so good is it good? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just wish we had avocado, but it's still really tasty. Yeah, I miss avocado. It's been a while. I know. They're never good. <laughs> so I am at the gym, and I really don't want to be here. Um, I just feel so lazy, and I just want to relax. But if I don't force myself on days like this, then I will... I will lose motivation, I'll lose that momentum, and I've really enjoyed um, having that routine back again where I was working out, uh, you know, four days a week, and I felt really good the last couple of weeks that I've been doing that, so um, it's okay if some days I don't feel it, and I just skip a workout, that's fine, but I've done that Monday and Tuesday, so tonight I'm forcing myself to get to the gym and yeah, thank goodness I'm vlogging because um, that always helps motivate me because I want to show you guys like, you know, if a tired, lazy, pregnant woman can do it, anybody can do it. And what always helps me is when I'm feeling either really tired or really busy, I always think there's there's other people in the world who are 10 times more tired or 10 times more busy than I am who are still getting it done. So that always gives me that motivation to just come and get it over with and pretty much halfway through, I'm always glad I came. So I can't manage to like make myself look excited because I'm really not feeling it, but I'm gonna get it done. I'm here, I got here. So I'm probably gonna do uh, 15, 20 minutes of dumbbell exercises and I just use 10 pounds um, and I sit so that I'm not using back muscles or abdomen muscles. Um, I just basically do like bicep curls and tricep extensions and overhead things and stuff like that. And I'm gonna, I've been doing the elliptical the last couple weeks but tonight I'm going to do the treadmill because I just want to be on a flat surface strolling at a moderate pace because um, I think that will be better for my back pain. <sighs> That's it so I'm going to get started before I continue procrastinating. some time with Jim and Oliver and that's it so if you enjoyed spending the day with me please give this video a thumbs up look at me multitasking don't forget to subscribe for more videos listen to Oliver bark and I'll see you in the next video bye no barking Oliver you made me out to be a liar